Hey guys, welcome back for another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you a quick and easy fix to error code 268 on Roblox, which basically tells you that you've been kicked out of the server due to unexpected client behavior. Now, if you are seeing that error, don't worry, you've done nothing wrong at all. And there's nothing wrong with your account as well. We just need to check and fix a few network settings and you'll be back online in no time. So first thing you want to do is open up the command prompt. You can do that by typing in command in the search bar and you will see it as one of the top options. Right click on it and select run as administrator. This is important because if you don't run it as administrator, some of the, changing, uh, some of the changes may not take effect. Once you've opened up command prompt and I've zoomed it a bit here so that you can see it clearly, you need to type in ipconfig. That is I-P-C-O-N-F-I-G space and then forward slash flush DNS. Now this is a command that you run to flush the DNS cache. This is not going to affect your system in any bad way. The next command you need to run is net sh winsock reset. And this will reset the winsock catalog. So these are a couple of network settings that you need to reset. Um, and then once you've done that, let me zoom back out a little bit. You need to clear out the temp folder on your desktop or laptop. Just type in percent temp percent, which is the shortcut to navigate to the temp folder. Hit enter and you'll be navigated to the temp folder. Uh, you can blindly select everything within the temp folder and press shift and delete, or you can just right click and select delete to delete everything that's in the temp folder. Temp folder is a temporary folder that houses um, files that are temporarily created by applications while they are running. Deleting the files from this folder is not going to affect your PC in any bad way. And depending on how much data you have in the temp folder, this might take a couple of minutes to clear out. And once you've done that, last but not the least, you need to check the DNS settings for which just right click on your network options, go into network and internet settings. Within that, you need to go in to your network and sharing center within which you're going to see, um, you're going to see network options and go into change adapter settings. Within the adapter settings, you'll see the various adapters depending on whether you're using Wi-Fi or Ethernet. You can choose the appropriate one for yourself. Right click, go into properties and go into internet protocol, which is the option right here. And once again, select properties, change the DNS server settings to use the following server DNS server addresses. Type in what I'm typing in on the screen, um, which is the preferred DNS server should be 1.1.1.1 and the alternate DNS server should be 1.0.0.1. Once you've done that, just press OK all the way and hit close. Um, and by this time, uh, most of your temp files that you were trying to delete would have been deleted. If any files cannot be deleted because they are in use, you can just hit skip and skip those. And you can do those for all the items that need to be skipped. Now, once you've followed all the three steps that I've shown you here, you can go ahead and restart your desktop and laptop and get back into Roblox and you won't see the issue anymore. So that's how easy it is to fix it. Let me know your feedback about whether or not this fix worked for you. Do give me your feedback in the comments. Do subscribe to the channel and thank you for watching.